Hi, I'm Randy Reed. It's Today in Lighting, Tuesday, 12 September. We're sponsored by Halco Lighting, where they strive to be your first choice as a lighting technology partner. Here are the stories making news. Yesterday, ADLT acquired Cree Lighting, Inc., which includes Cree Lighting Canada and Econolite from Ideal Industries. Perhaps I should say reacquired, as this is the second time ADLT has owned a piece of this business. The ideal thing was never ideal from the beginning, and we're trying to learn the details of the financial transaction to see what kind of a hit ideal took. CIE has recently released a new technical note, Second International Workshop on Circadian and Neurophysiological Photoreception. Although it does promote the blue enriched lumen at 6500K, I do give them credit for making the TN only 17 pages. It discusses findings from the workshop and is relatively easy to read. Your humble editor is trying hard to learn about a relatively new entrant to the architectural lighting industry, and that is the integrator. I met a few of them at Light Fair and Education. I'm captivated by what they do, and I spent some time with them at the recent Cedia Expo in Denver last week. IES is offering a comprehensive 20 session training program for lighting professionals led by renowned designer Janet Lennox Moyer called Learn Night Light. It covers landscape lighting, illumination science, human perception of light, and more. Details at designinglighting.com. On a personal note, we're very excited to welcome Bridget Leary as our new administrative coordinator here at the Edison Report. She holds a Bachelor of Science in Media and Communications with a digital marketing focus from East Tennessee State University. Bridget's background in social media, public relations, and photography will enhance our capacity to efficiently deliver industry news. Yesterday, the Dow was up 87 points. NASDAQ increased 156, but in spite of that, Orion lost 6%. That's it. Go light up the world. Have a great day. Pray for peace.